Minnesota fighting Viking superstar wide receiver Justin freaking Jefferson is multifaceted. Number one, he is the best wide receiver in the National Football League. Number two, he's going to get uh, paid, hopefully very soon, uh, likely become the highest paid receiver in NFL history, rightfully so. And also, he is a cultural phenomena in that he... Well, he didn't create. Uh, a, a guy they knew from back in the day created the dance, but he he put the gritty, the dance, on the map, and everyone and their mom is doing it. Uh, uh, him and Jamar Chase and LSU really popularized it. And by the way, if you watch, if you go to any kid's sporting event, like uh, peewee football, basketball, t-ball, gymnastics, whatever, after every single play, after every single basket, it's just like dun, 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 dun. kids. Love the gritty. It's honestly taken over the globe. It's phenomenal, man. Uh, soon to be taken over the globe is uh, Jordan Addison, the Vikings' first round pick out of USC. Na 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 na. -na. Formerly a pet, you know, whatever. But Addison uh, is coming into the Vikings, and he even said on draft night that he, there's going to be tons of gritting all over the place because there's going to be scoring touchdowns all night. And the Vikings with Addison and Jefferson and KJ are going to be a true three deep and long term. Jefferson and Addison is it going to be Batman and Robin Batman and Batman I, I don't know but we have a couple issues All right so first off doing the gritty All right and now the video has emerged from we are SC of Jordan Addison uh doing the gritty now this is in pregame warm-ups Coliseum uh, pl plenty of good seats available of course LA crowds LA crowds are sort of like Miami no one shows up on time Hmm. Uh, usually because of traffic in LA, but uh, Addison here, pregame warmups, and this isn't really the full gritty. Like he, he's not going up with the goggles. He ain't doing that. But all, all the footwork is there. And of course, Jordan Addison is renowned as one of the best route runners, if not the best route runner in the 2023 class. So he, he's got the lower half down. Like he's got good rhythm. He's got the bend. Yeah, he's got bend, can get around the edge, and we just need to see the pop. So it's like he's three-quarter of the way to a gritty, right? And obviously that's going to be his first touchdown dance when uh, week one he, he scores two. Because week one, I have a feeling whoever the Vikings play, schedule's coming out soon, that they're going to double and triple Jefferson, and Addison is just going to be wide open spaces. So he's going to have to work on this. Like, he's going to need a little bit of polish on the thing. But overall, you know, the RAS scores aren't very good for the gritty, but I think he's elite. I, I think he is absolutely elite. Because just look at the footwork. Look at the bounce. He's got more bounce for the ounce. Yeah, he's going to be fine. No, he just needs to get the, the upper body. He's going to be good to go there. While he's at it, if you want to teach Caleb Williams how to do the gritty, I mean, we can just save some time. Just a crash course for 2024. Mm -hmm. After the Vikings trade up from 32 to go get him. Ah, got him. But uh, your thoughts are thoughts. Uh, new Vikings receiver Jordan Addison. Eh, the gritty needs a little bit of work. But we got time. And I have a feeling that Jefferson and KJ and Addison and TJ are going to do a lot of gritties. Although, Hawkinson's gritty. Anyways, let us know your thoughts and our thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Once worth the work, put a little something in the Venmo. But to next time, Skull Production Value.